Hello folks and welcome back to the Vertigo Tea Party and let's play Skyrim. No major quests I don't think. Well, there's this one quest, Dreams in Oblivion, but I'm not sure if that's actually here in Falskar. I thought it was, but I don't think it might be. But so anyway, I went ahead and just picked another miscellaneous quest. Might have to run back here off camera and start talking to some NPCs to see if we can't find some more major, well, semi-major quests. I won't bother recording that. That's not like, super entertaining to watch. So, one interesting thing is coming to YouTube very soon. They are going to be supporting 45 and 60 frame per second videos. I'm very much looking forward to that. Granted, it's not going to make the texture look any better than it's already been mauled by the YouTube encoder. So that's still going to be kind of crappy. Oh, that's a... That's cute. Whoa, hey. Whoa, that was some weird lag. I didn't hit that bear on purpose. But uh, yeah, that will be pretty awesome. That mother damn it. So uh, yeah, definitely looking forward to that. I, I've been recording it. I haven't actually been recording in frame or in uh, 60 frames a second for too long. Obviously, you wouldn't be able to tell, but. The main reason I do it, because people ask me, like, why do you bother? Why do you bother recording in 60 frames a second? YouTube can't support it. I'm like, okay, well, first off, YouTube at some point will support it. When? I don't know. I don't know why I cast that spell either. Twice. But it will eventually. Almost certainly. Oops. Let's do this right. So at some point they will, and maybe it'll be retroactive almost certainly won't actually be retroactive but you know you never know it could be summon a storm at Trinoc. because why not i'm sure as soon as we open this gate i'm sure as we find a way into this place we under attack this is a big ass fort holy shit they should just moved over here god damn wait is this where we're going uh, yes. Build the bandit leader at Brittle Cave. Brittle Run Cave. I right, assume there's a cave around here. Or maybe it's in here. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Regardless, I'm pretty excited about that. 60 frames a second definitely notices. And I know, or is noticeable. I know there's a lot of hoo-ha, back and forth bullshit about console. Good lord, this place is huge. About, you know, 720p versus 1080, and then 60 versus 30 frames per second, and blah, blah, blah. You can argue all you want that 1080 and 720p are, are close enough not to matter. You're totally, you're probably not going to notice, notice until you see side by side, blah, blah, blah. 30 versus 60 frames a second, though? 60 frames a second is absolutely, without question, noticeable. Like, without question. Like, that is just not even an arguable defense that you can make, as far as I'm concerned. And I actually did see, they've already got some test videos up of some peop of some videos, 60 frames a second. And I don't think there were stellar examples, but there are definitely parts in those videos where, are, where it is, without question, noticeably different at 60 frames a second. What in the hell? How do I get in here? Cause that door sure as hell will not open. We got to wait. Wait, can I get over here? Oh God, no! Wait, no, wait. Well, what am I missing here? Look at the walls. Did I do another quest that blocked that place off, and now I'm not going to get in there? If so, that would suck pretty bad. Be pretty goddamn lame. No, oh, it's definitely not right there. But yeah, I'm looking for the 60 frames a second. Now, for what it's worth, I'm not getting 60 frames a second now. Uh, I usually get around 40 to 45, sometimes 30. Wait, is this gonna be one of those things where there's like a knob somewhere that I can I have to push? I can't run into it. Well, I can, but. Doesn't do me much good. Makes me a little tired. 
get some splinters in my face. What the hell? Well, maybe we won't be doing this quest. Fuck. That's unfortunate. Well, fuck. Well, I guess I'll be going back to town, and uh, I guess I'll abandon this quest and try to find some others. So I did find out that priory mission is here. We found the hideout. Well, I looked up where it was because I wasn't sure this was the right mission. Well, I actually became sure that it was the right place, uh, but then I couldn't be arsed to find it because the NPC wouldn't give me any hints and I ran out of patience. You open the book to read it and a mysterious crystal falls out. Out. Calls, fall, falls out from a space between some of the pages. You place it back in the book. This would certainly be of interest to Brother Arnand. I've finally done it! I've located the long-lost Adric artifact known as the Dream Crystals. However, I have run into a problem. There is some kind of protective magic shielding them from our world. They are useless to me in this state. Luckily for me, my, recently ex my recent expeditions into the magics of necromancy have allowed me to meet some pertinent individuals. I will show them the crystals and see if they will help me decide the code, the magic within. You gotta look at the magic within yourself. You don't need magic crystals. You don't need necromancy. The magic's within you. But maybe, maybe do some necromancy on the side. Because what's the worst thing that's ever happened with rampant use of necromancy? God motherfucking balls. Let's see, is this marked? Where are you at? There he is, he's in here. I made sure to wake them up earlier. You, I hope you're Whoa. keeping out of trouble. You don't have to get up, you can just talk. Oh, you're in the way. What can this humble monk help you with? I found Vernon's hideout. This journal was in it. Look what, what's inside of it. What is this? Some kind of a crystal. Hmm. I must do some reading on this. Please. Give me a day and then return. Motherfucker. I will need your further assistance. Uh. Oh, and here, for your time thus far. Thank you. What he really does is goddamned research. <sighs> Alright. Well, nobody else really talked to I me. I hope you're keeping out of trouble. I hope I'm not. Well, I guess I'll go back to Amber Creek, talk to some people, see if I can get some more quests. Ah, yeah, YMCA. All right, so I found out the blacksmith actually has a quest because I talked to him earlier, but I didn't record it. So anyway, so you got the best blacksmith in Falskar? Aye, but I owe it all to my father. He taught me everything I know. His father taught him and his father before and so on. Our family has run this blacksmith since Amber Creek was founded. Though, I fear I have no child to pass my knowledge on to. And I Shooting never blank, will, say. not after what happened to my wife. But, I do have Micaias. I don't think my father would mind that he isn't my son too much. It's about the knowledge, the craft, the skill. All that matters is that I teach someone. And one day, before I die, I'll craft my masterpiece. Just like my father did. Even if it was taken from him. What happened to your wife? She was visiting Pineway when it was attacked. About 20 years back. She... She didn't make it. She... She was pregnant at the time. I've moved you know the father was? She would have wanted me too. I fear I'm too old to have kids now. Well, good but news, you don't have to bear them, find actually. Another woman as beautiful and flawless as my Annalie. Are you concerned about your womb being barren? I got some good and bad news for you. Someone stole your father's masterpiece? Yes. Many years ago, my father grabbed the Jarl, Agnar's father, a great warhammer. Years later, when my father passed away, Agnar returned it to my family. We buried it with my father, in his honor. 
Any blacksmith should rest with the finest of his craft. But one day we found his grave dug up. The hammer was gone, stolen by someone. We had no evidence, but I know it was stolen by Garand. His family was always jealous of mine. Last I heard, he was hiding out at the old Aspenfall Lodge, to the southeast in the Amber Hole. I haven't a clue if he's still there, but it's certainly worth a try. If you can find my father's hammer, I will be greatly appreciated. He, he winks. All yeah. right. Turn this off. A craftsman's finest. Safe out there. Always. So how far is this place? Not too far. Let's play the where the fuck is my house game. Because for whatever reason, I have a super hard time remembering where the fuck my house is in this town. Let's use the cheat. Use the map. It's west. West. Yeah, okay, so this is it. I was like, ah, I don't think that's it. Because there's several times I'm like, oh, there's my house, and then it was somebody else's house. Then I was like, fuck it, my house now. And they're like, well, actually, sir. I'm like, no, no thanks. I'll be taking this. This is a nice little house, by the way. It's been nice if, you know, I'd have found it sooner, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Gotta get them extra XPs. Gotta get that destruction maxed. So I can reset it and start at 20. Yeah, no, I won't be doing that. That would suck. Eh, maybe it wouldn't be too bad. Now that Lydia's doing pretty damn good damage. Huh? 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 Alright, so surprise, Lydia. There's a surprise party, even though you're around me, watching me sleep. Holding that two-handed axe over my head. Gotta say, that creeps me out just a smidge. All right, let's buff up here. Nope. Uh, let's go with the seduction. Let's go with the seduction. Let's go with the... It's six. There it is. Uh, I don't know, whatever. I actually don't know if that was the right spell, but F it. Go ahead and get our buffs up. <laughs> Damn it, Lydia, relax! Holy shit, that's the most annoying thing ever. She keeps switching our weapons in and out. Alright. We need to unlock the ultimate spell. Buff myself. Just chain... cast all my buffs. Ah, yeah, this is that area we found before, and... Completely obliterated all the living humans. Save all the humans. Or kill them all, whichever. It doesn't even matter. I think I had that protection from human spell on. Make some effects. Protection. Protection from humans. Yep. Reduces damage taken from humans by 10%. I'll definitely take that. Shh, Lydia, we're gonna be sneaky. We're re-rolling into a sneak elf. Or a sneak elf, a sneak... Got anyone out there? Who's in the dark back there? Nobody! Just do what now? Boom! <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> the charm doesn't really help when you have a... A companion, because they just keep attacking your companion. At least they won't attack me. That's all that really matters, isn't it, Lydia? Eh, it's pretty crappy. Damn it, that noise. I think that, that buff with the thing that makes them give you soul gems, or fill soul gems automatically, I think that does that. It's very annoying. Let me guess. I won't be able to summon these guys, or raise these guys from the dead. Hey. Actually, they weren't that tough. Oh, hello. We're moving! I've done it! I've gotten the hammer! Those fools! Announcing to the world that they were burying it with Gustav made it real easy. I went to his grave during the night and I dug it up. 
But I have to hide it. I must keep it safe. The lodge won't do any more. Too close. Too civilized. There's an old mine not far from here called Shattered Hand Redoubt. It's abandoned now, but we'll head there. We can hide out and keep the hammer safe. I'm heading there tomorrow morning. Then they won't be able to get me. They won't even know where I am. Hey, Janal, if you find this, gather a bunch of the lads and meet me there. Also, make sure you destroy this letter before you leave. You can't leave a paper trail. Yet, apparently, no one in this world, one, ever destroys these letters, and two, remembers that they are supposed to destroy these letters. You'd think they would eventually realize those two things and be like, hey. <laughs> That's interesting dialogue from the bandit. Saying it would be easier if people just gave me their money. I like your way you think, Bandit. Yeah, it's definitely this buff that's causing that annoying noise. Sorry about that. My peoples. But okay, first of all, King and I know, nitpicking. Oh, she just got a little voice on her. That's sweet. Too bad she's only got about a minute and a half. Of life left, or unlife, if you prefer. But anyway, yeah, as I was saying, a dead high elf is a good high elf. Almost as good as a ned, dead naked high elf. But yeah, as I was saying, how much money I will make next time. <laughs> I wonder if they normally say that when they're idling, the bandits, that is. Because I'm pretty sure that's new voice acting too, right? I'm assuming... So I don't think that's just the default. I could be wrong though. It happens. Rare, but it does. At any rate... How far is this? Not very. But yeah, so apparently his father died and he buried the thing with him. Very good, Lydia. But we're supposed to believe, and it does, he made it sound like it's been a while, like his dad's been dead a while. Made it sound that way. So I not only would that guy have stolen it a long time ago, if that's the case, but that note would still be there just laying on the floor. What was that? Your death. Boom! Ho, 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 ho! You gotta give that props. I timed that shit like a goddamn boss. Where'd he go? Lydia, get him. I'll hold this ball of fire. Oh, is he hauling ass again? You piece of shit. Nope. I only use fire against casters, apparently. Bam, <laughs> barely even phasing Lydia. Look at her. That resists, son. He's like, shit, she's so resistant to everything. And she's like, I know. <laughs> Here's my two handed axe, bitch. You carry this, the star port of my blade into hell. I don't know. I was going with a sworn to carry your burdens joke again. And then I was going to say something about he was going to carry. The wound from... I don't know. God, who knows. Anyway. So yeah, that note's been there for years, I guess. Unless you were trying to say, oh, well, he recently stole it. But I definitely didn't get that impression. But, seriously, we're nitpicking a free, user-made, huge mod. So, let's not be a dick. If we can help it. Well, let's try to be less of a dick. Go ahead and summon this guy. Archers are good. Ooh, actually, you know what? I like casters even more. F you. Shut up, Lydia. Not apparently not that either. Well, F it all. I didn't really mean to do that. Um. Like a wall of frost. That's helping. Huh. That didn't really seem to do a lot of damage. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. Hello. 
Oops, sorry, Lydia. That makes you look scarier. You're scaring the shit out of him. Why did you fail, though, really? I mean, you're just a marauder. I mean, you failed at marauding. Okay. Sorry, Mama. You always said I could be anything. Apparently, marauding wasn't in that list. Picked a very specific skill set that I lacked. I knew I should have went to Harvard. Hello? Nice. 